what kind of was going on in that dugout during this game? I mean, there were four lead changes. You guys fall behind, and then that big seven-run seventh inning. Well, I mean, when we got down, no heads were really down. We just every inning come come in the dugout and figure out what we got to do to get on, and just we were really focusing on the run, just getting quality at bats and everyone on base. How were you guys able in that inning particular uh, able to kind of just continue to get a guy up there and you know you had some flares you had some bloops whatever it took you you guys didn't have you know a, a grand slam or anything no big bop but you know just continued to push the lineup down farther and farther and get guys on base that way well that's one of the things in our offense is really important is is fighting at bats and keep getting guys on and, and no matter how we do it so that really helped and just once people just start getting on base it just started rolling from there tell me uh when you see the ball go over the center fielder's head on your inside of the park home run, and you're probably about halfway to, to second, and you're thinking, what, what's kind of going through your mind? There? Do you think are you thinking maybe inside the park? Is that? No, I actually wasn't thinking. I was thinking triple, and then once I started getting closer to third base, I saw our coach started waving me. So I was trying to kick it into another gear if I had it and get there safe. And a uh, nice slide on that play as well to avoid the tag and to throw a little bit up the line. Um, what kind of has been your role at the top of this lineup? What, what is, have you tried to do to, to be productive and help this team? Well, I think I've really tried to just get the ball on the ground or line drives and just really use my speed and get on base and try to get to second and third, and it's really helped. How has it been for this team, you guys going for the first month, really, really struggling to, you know, knowing that you basically got to win the Pac-12 once you get in the conference play, get going, and, and you know, win a couple series. People are still doubting you. Uh, to kind of play it out, and now you guys have earned at least a share of the Pac-12. Well, yeah, when we won the Oregon series, that's, I think, really all, everyone on our team really saw that we were just as good, if not better, as everyone else in the pack, and then we started winning a couple more series, and it started getting serious, and we all just try to work as hard as we could to come on top. Does the Pac-12 share of the title mean anything to you guys? Or, I mean, you know you got to win tomorrow to get into a regional, so does this win mean anything? Or is it all about tomorrow? It's all about tomorrow. We, I mean, sharing the Pac-12 would be nice, but we really want to be up there all by ourselves.